In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can embed a Google app, for example, a Google Sites within Frontend without having to leave the learning platform and visit your, uh, your website. It looks something like this. So if I click this link, the Google Sites website would now launch within the frame of Frontend. So how do you do that? Well, that's pretty straightforward. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is you need the URL from your Google Sites. So if I go into my Google Sites, and here we go, highlight that, go back into Frontier. You go into your room, because in your room you have something called Customize Tool Package. Um, so from this drop down menu, you choose Customize Tool Package, and within this you can control what's on this. Um, on the left-hand menu, so you can you can you know you can uh, modify things, you can move things up and down. So I'm going to show you just how to add a quick link. So if you click New Tool, and you notice that front is is packed with uh, with opportunities for learning. So here you're going to choose User Defined Button. So click there and give it a name. And since I've used um, a project website, I'm going to call this Year Seven project yep. website I'm not going to add a description I paste the code in there and I will keep in the same window so it opens within the frame of Frontier otherwise you can of course open up in a new window I choose save and now I will decide where this going to turn up so if you look here, if I click here you notice that there are arrows that turn up so I can choose where on the left hand side I'd like this to turn up. So let's say for example, well I'd, I'd like it to be somewhere in the middle, I would see, so I'd click a few more times there. Oh, it's a little bit too far up. So I've got about there, I click save. And there you have it. So if I click Year 7 Project Website, it's the, um, that user defined button we created, the Google site will appear within the frame or within Frontier. Nice and straightforward.